Hello. Good morning. Well, it's morning here in Los Angeles. Um, I'm doing some reading before I... These glasses. I can't see a thing. <laughs> okay. and But there's a glare right here in, in the glass. But anyhow, um, I'm doing some scripture reading uh, before I head up into the office and start my work day. But uh, I think it's, it's important if you can set some time in the morning to start your day off with reading the word and prayer but I'm reading right now in the book of Colossians uh, chapter 3 and I want to share and it kind of is an extension to the video that I made yesterday on January mm, let's see what was the date yesterday I believe it's January the 8th uh, it was on Monday today's I'm gonna check right now. Oh, I can't. Anyhow, I'm on my, using my phone, but I think it's January 8th or 9th. But anyhow, I wanna read Colossians chapter three to extend from yesterday's video talking about love. Verse 12. Therefore, as the elect of God, holy and beloved, put on tender mercies, kindness, humility, meekness, long-suffering, bearing with one another and forgiving one another. If anyone has a complaint against another, even as Christ forgave you, so you also must do. Having kindness, kindness can be exercised easily. Um, being kind, opening and holding the door open for a lady or for a man or, who, or just doing a kind deed for somebody. Even if it's, you know, um, what is the word I want to say? Even if it's like difficult to be kind to certain individuals, but because Christ dwells inside of you, you can. You need to activate the fruits of the Spirit, which is kindness and, and loving and peace, peaceable. Um, towards your brother or sister and just even strangers I want to continue reading on verse 14 but above all these things put on love which is the bond of per perfection so if you have love it says right here which is the bond of perfection you know I, I'm not perfect I'm never going to say I'm perfect but reading that, it just you know tells you that love is powerful. And when you demonstrate love towards towards people, you know it, it really is uplifting for your spirit and for your mind. Just being kind and gentle. I want to read on verse 15 of Colossians chapter 3. Let the word of Christ dwell in you richly in all wisdom. Those of you who, who want wisdom, ask the Lord. Lord, please, if it is your will, Lord, I want wisdom. Your wisdom, not the wisdom that the world gives, but the world's wisdom that the Father up in heaven gives. That That's the wisdom you want to have. Um, continuing on, teaching and admoni admonishing admonitioning one another that's kind of a hard word for me to say in psalms and hymns and spiritual songs singing with grace in your hearts to the lord when you sing and worship to the lord it really it, it does something to you it, it just gets you like like uh, excited and rejuvenated when, when one prays and, and sings songs to the lord and though it, it's sometimes you don't know what to sing, but the Holy Spirit will put it into your mind what to speak, to, what to sing, you know. Even if it's an old classic hymn like, Ah, fly away, O oh glory, ah, fly away. When I die, hallelujah, by and by, ah, fly away. I love that hymn song. It, it really it, it touches my my heart. Um, 
but you know, I, I I'm not singing or or reading the scripture to boast in myself. You know, it's just all glory to God, and um, I'm actually kind of surprised I'm, I'm making videos. Uh, it was never my intention to make videos on YouTube, but the Lord, um, he hook in line brought me in. Armando, <laughs> here's a ministry here. And at least that's what I've been told about my videos, that this is a ministry. And the more I think about it, yes. So I, I want to make sure that I'm presenting myself to be Christ-like character and, and being kind and loving towards towards those who are on YouTube. Even though I don't see and know anyone on YouTube, but I pray, and it is my prayer, that my videos make an impact on people's lives and, and in their hearts and bring them peace and, and joy within and comfort. Because um, I'm just a, you know, a person, I'm just a man, but I did ask the Lord, Lord, please use me, I'm your vessel use me and you know what when you ask the Lord something and uh, he, he 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 gives and he did with me you know and I'm actually a little surprised <laughs> how bold the, the Lord the Holy Spirit can make you you know um, I've never been bold like this to to make a video uh, talking about the Lord but um, I just want to want to share some words of encouragement for you today and for every day so sing praises to the lord be loving and kind and gentle to your fellow man fellow woman um hold the door open for that lady walking into the department store wait department store i'm sounding like like an old man <laughs> using words like department store um anyhow i'm, I'm just rambling now but i'm going to put this to close because i get i need to get ready to go up into work and check in but I'll pray really quick. Heavenly Father, I I lift up these people on YouTube, Lord, to you, Father God. I, I pray and ask that you just bless them, Lord. Provide for them. Give them wisdom, Lord. I, I pray for wisdom for, for the YouTube people and for those who are struggling and in, in dealing with issues of life, Lord. Struggling with their finances, illnesses, Lord. Um, broken marriages, struggling marriages, Lord. I lift them all up to you, Lord, all the people on YouTube. Though they're strangers, but we're connected through the Spirit, Lord. Because of the Holy Spirit's power, we could all be one, the body of Christ, Heavenly Father. And if there's any unbelievers that watch and listen to this video, Lord, pierce their heart, open up their heart to you, Father God, that they accept and believe in you, Jesus. Before that door closes, and it's too late for them. And they will be in the tribulation, Lord. And if that's the case, Father God, I pray for those who are left behind that during the time of tribulation, they will be saved. But now is the time of salvation, Father God. So I pray for all these people on the YouTube, Lord. In Jesus' mighty name, amen. Have a wonderful day. And God bless you.